name's Jade Foster and welcome to Decoy TV. Today we're interviewing our captain at Sticky Mike's Frog Bar. So let's get out of the cold, into the warm and see what they've got to say. Welcome to Decoy TV. Today I am with O Captain. If you'd like Hello. to introduce yourselves. Hello, I'm Joe. I'm Jamie. <laughs> I'm Sadie. <laughs> I'm Hope. <laughs> Fighting over the microphone. Um, so obviously, like you're all in matching stripy tops. That's not that, is that a coincidence, or is there is is there a is there a theme going on, or what, what, is there a no, reason? We're a very coordinated band in. Uh, or Captain Towers, we decided today we were going to dress as sailors. Um, this gig is themed around B-movies, and um, being old captain, we decided to come as dead sailors. Yeah, we've yet don't to look very dead. Yeah, I was about to say, you look pretty alive right now. This time. Yeah. yeah. It's, uh, it's a performance. We'll come later. <laughs> um, so tell us a bit about yourself. Like, how, how long have you been together? And did you sort of meet in Brighton, or whereabouts are you from? Well, we all met in Brighton. And uh, we were all like solo artists, I think, that kind of, we just sort of met at open mic night, like me, Hope, and Sadie originally. And Joe's the newbie, he's just joined recently. New one. Uh, yeah, we've been going for about a year and a half, and uh, loving it. Yeah. From my perspective, I, I've, I've only been living in Brighton like a year and a half, and I played um, an acoustic show, and it was the very first one I ever played in Brighton. And Hope and Jamie happened to both be sitting directly in front of me. No <laughs> Under idea pressure. who they were. It was like some weird kind of fate thing that just happened and then we just Your eyes of, met from across the yeah, room. Yeah, no, it was. It was yeah. like love at first sight, really. Yeah, so. um, well, how it began was um, Hope asked me to put some drums to some of her acoustic tracks. Mm -hmm. Did that. And then Jamie came along. Just walked in. Just, just walked in. It was just <laughs> like, I'm here. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. Now. yeah, that's pretty much how it was. Um, pretty much, very persistent. <laughs> now he's here to stay. <laughs> um, yeah, and then we, we started off playing kind of like acoustic shows, um, but then I kind of realised that I like to play drums a bit louder. So <laughs> yeah, I think kind of if you're playing we, drums, you got to play a little bit louder, haven't you? Yeah, going electric, and then then Joe came along pretty recently, and. Um, Da, 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 da. Halo. <laughs> Save the day. And um, yeah, we just made the sound kind of a whole lot, um, you know, more, more, more bassier. 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 That is a, that is a word, a word in the dictionary. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that, that's pretty much the, the story of O Captain. And um, so, what about your live performance and, and your songs? Uh, they're very much themed around sort of zombie apocalypses and, and there's quite a few drug references and things like that. I presume the zombie apocalypse isn't autobiographical. I sort of hope it's not. Um, but so how do you get the inspiration for, for songs like that? Because obviously people usually write songs about what they know. And, and uh, I'm not sure. Uh, you mean you might know about zombie apocalypse. I'm not, I'm not denying that. But sort of how, how do you sort of write those songs? I mean, I don't know who well, writes them. Um, but. We're basically all just like massive geeks and we watch loads of old zombie movies and things like that. And quite a lot of like what, what we're kind of trying to promote is about kind of like surviving just through things. Yeah. And like the worst thing you could probably go through is a zombie apocalypse, you know, when everything ends. Yeah, yeah. So quite, quite like uh, quite a few of our songs stem from this kind of really fantasy based idea just from us all kind of watching mm -hmm. like old zombie movies and like loads of sci-fi. And then, but then obviously like bringing that into real life and actually the things you can kind of apply. Yeah, it's like metaphorical. Know? Yeah, yeah, completely. Yeah. Oh, okay, so do you write songs as a band or is it just there is, you sort of pitch songs to oh, each other? Or Yeah, well, uh, we, yeah, it's kind of a bit of both. Yeah. We, um, we kind of usually get into the kind of practice room and make noise at each other until we're all nearly deaf and then we have a song. <laughs> You guys 
guys are quite energetic on stage, sort of notoriously energetic, but um, you're sort of going to stop that for a while and go in the studio, apparently? Yeah, Perhaps? Yeah. Are you looking forward to that? What, what are, you are you recording an EP, an LP? We're recording a full album this time, because okay. we've got an EP out at the moment, okay. which is, you can download on our website. You can download um, it on their website. We can, you can download which is, it. You, which is? That's you. And you can download it on? Which is uh, weareocaptain.com. Okay. Just follow the links and that'll take you through to it. Um, or you can go onto our Bandcamp, just put in Bandcamp O Captain, that'll bring it up as well. We've also got merchandise on there. Buy our merchandise. Merchandise Please. is a big thing for bands. <laughs> So yeah, we had the EP and now we're doing the album because we've, we've been sitting on these songs for about a year and a half. Yeah. Um, and we just haven't been able to get it together like mm -hmm. financially or whatever and get the yeah. time off to like yeah. go and do it. So we're finally going to go and do it now. And we've got a place booked in Southampton. So huh? Jamie, like, speaking of bands, so how Jamie. would we fund said album? Oh <laughs> uh, yes, it's funny you should mention that because we recently filmed a Kickstarter. Oh, yes. Kickstarter, That's tell right. us about your yeah, Kickstarter. Kickstarter. Please. So we've done a video um, we did a video recently and went out into the countryside and pretended that we were killing each other and things like that. Um, and basically, we've got loads of awesome bundles of loads of cool stuff that you can have if you donate us some money so that we can pay for our album. Um, is there a link to that on your website? There is not at the moment because we're still putting the video together. On your Facebook. But there will be. And if you go onto our Facebook, all of See? the information you need will be on there. You can find it. So make sure you go on there. You know, you can get like digital downloads, um, which will which only be like a five or something. But then we're going to add loads of other stuff like um, little like uh, podcasts of us doing uh, acoustic versions of a few yep. of the songs. There's going to be a whole new range of t-shirts as well, which is like... That's like, exciting. Yeah, which we're really excited about. Yeah. Um, which is all kind of based around uh, the, the ship that's on our old t-shirt. It like meets the land and all these new t-shirts going to be about the horrible things that are going on there. Yeah. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, and there's going to be that. And then, yeah, we're just loads of other really odd stuff, like us writing your name on our bodies. See, the more you donate, the better the, the better the bundles get. <laughs> yeah. Sort of um, the point of Kickstarter, really, but you know, <laughs> yeah. So you'll use that to fund your album. Yeah, okay. and you know, and also everything else that goes with the album, because we kind of want to start like gigging quite quite a bit more with the album. Yeah, and, like, yeah. Go around the country and travel and yeah. be all bandy. So yeah. yeah. Speaking of tours, day. are there any other future plans for O Captain over the summer, like festivals or? Well, hopefully. I mean, like th this summer, we're really going to focus on getting our album done as much as possible. But hopefully next year, we're going to. Yeah, try and tour and like try and uh, tour with bands that we're quite similar to as well. Which yeah, sometimes can be a little bit difficult to find. It's important though, I think, because you're going to attract the same crowd. Yeah, so yeah, com completely. And we're yeah. hoping that next next summer it'll all build up to us playing at more like uh, genre-based festivals with our kind of music. Yeah, and d and just going down that road of kind of like, yeah. So uh, yeah, we're, uh, we're we're mega excited. We've, okay. we've all booked like five days off, and we're yeah. we're staying at the studio as well. That's really cool. It, Where else is the studio? It's a converted ranch outside Southampton. That sounds so it's really like, good. Um, it's called the ranch, isn't it? Yeah. Um, and the fudge. The ranch. The oh, fudge. <laughs> I <laughs> said the fudge. I really like sweet the things. The ranch. So I'm obviously yeah. gonna <laughs> on the break. <laughs> so I have one last question. I don't know. You probably. You've already, you've already, you already know what it is. I saw you. I saw you looking at the questions. <laughs> would you? Is it? It's a. Would you rather question? It's just a bit of fun, you know. A bit of bit of fun. Um, would you rather have fingers as long as your legs, or legs as long as your fingers? Have fingers as long as your legs, or legs as long as your fingers? Well, that's a no-brainer. Yeah, fingers as long as your legs. You can like reach. But walking down the street would be a nightmare. So would it be with little legs as well? <laughs> Oh. You this is true. You up. make a good point. Can you imagine the physical torture? Yeah. I just you feel like you'd, be, you'd crush, like you'd, the rest of your body would crush. <laughs> the way. Yeah. Like, you, so you would Yeah. You, you would just, you would just have stumps. Where would you find <laughs> shoes? Where would you put? Yeah, but where? Yeah. Shoes? Yeah, yeah this is true. <laughs> <laughs> doll shoes, like little dollies, just little steal their shoes dollies. in shops and run out. Yeah, okay. but your legs would be that. Your feet would be like that. Yeah, no, yeah. You choose about that bit. You just like, go to shake someone's hand and you kick them five times. It's like. <laughs> yeah. That's yeah. High fives would be great. If you met High someone, fives if you awesome. That is so true. Same, it'd be like. Earthquake. Thank you so much for letting me interview you and uh, good right. luck tonight. Thank you.
Well, I'm sure you'll be more dead later. Yeah, in the oh. best, posi in the most positive yeah, yeah, way. Yeah, um, but way yeah, um, thank you so much for watching. Um, and stay tuned for more interviews.